YouTube, YouTube, YouTube. It's been, it's been a minute. Um, it's been a while, folks. Uh, hope you're doing well. Hope this message or video finds you well. Um, it's been a long time since I, I uploaded a video. I know, I know. I've just been, I'm not gonna, I'm not even gonna give an excuse. Oh, uh, to why I haven't posted a video in so long. I just been all over the place. Um, just mentally, spiritually, emotionally, physically, everything. I've just been all over the place. But I picked up this camera. I was like, you know what? Let me at least just post a video. But just one video. Just one video. That's it. So uh, here we go. And um, I'm just going to straight up address the reason why I am no longer wanting to pursue per pressure washing as a, as a business. I just don't think it's scalable, first and foremost. Um, I think, okay, let me rephrase that. I don't think it is scalable in the sense like you can you can do various, there's various types of jobs you can have. That's the wrong word. But I think there's a cap to it. This is just my own personal assessment. I could be wrong and I want to be wrong. And I'm not saying this to just discourage anyone's like passion or Oh, dreams of pursuing pressure washing. I'm just saying from my own personal experience, after observing the industry, watching so many videos and looking at what people are doing, um, I don't I don't think this is a like a multi million dollar business thing that could happen. I, I think it's just one of those things where you do it for like a it's a, like a little side hustle that you just do for a while just to get some extra cash which you can possibly turn into a business, but even still with turning into a business, I don't think um, it's sustainable in this economy. I don't, I don't think it's, it's it's sustainable. That's why if you're gonna go all the way, if somebody were to go all the way, you need to have um, a continuity plan. Um, you have to be doing something else on the side. So example, if I'm doing pressure washing, right? I have to be trying to build a YouTube channel. Um, looking for other ways to to generate cash flow, not because it's 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 at first it's really unreliable to just go all in with pressure washing without like having a stable source of income elsewhere. Because when things go south and you don't have any jobs, you're 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 screwed in a sense. So um, I might make another video on this because I have more thoughts, um, but that's just. Hopefully you get the gist of why I'm not pursuing this uh, this um, um, this venture. I, I don't think it's something that's really sustainable in the long run. Because if I want to do a business, right, I want to do something that's going to last decades. And that it's not just tailored to one um, group of people. Because that's the other thing with pressure washing. With What I've noticed is like a lot of neighborhoods I've gone into... A lot of people already have the pressure washers. And when you try to sell them a service, nine times out of 10, they're gonna say no because they already know how to do it. They have the equipment. It really isn't that difficult. They know how to do it. They have the equipment. Um, yeah, you may say, some people might say, oh, well, some people are too busy. They don't have the time. But I beg to differ, you know? I've been to places where it's some nice neighbor, beautiful neighborhoods where well-developed even some average neighborhoods too people just are either okay it's either like you have like multiple investment properties or like a property property manager or like a real estate agent and you have multiple properties you're managing and you just want to get somebody who can go there and just clean in that sense yeah or if you're like a business and you don't have the the, the appropriate equipment um, to clean or even apartment complexes complexes or like airports and whatnot just really large um, organizations rather than residential um, in an organizational sense yes you will get jobs but in a residential sense it's it's, it's ever so often you find um, it's oh it's so it's more likely that you find people who actually know what they're doing they don't want you to do it and they do it so that's just my thoughts if you think i'm wrong if you have your own thoughts please comment 
don't sit quiet. I want to get into some good conversations. I want to learn from people. I want to understand what you're thinking, what you're, what you're, what's going on in your head. If you're successful in this industry or you're doing really well, I want to hear that too. Um, but um, without further ado, that's about it. I mean, that's pretty much the main reason. So moving forward, I'm probably just going to like, first of all, I'm a student. I'm a, I'm a college student. So I really want to finish school, get a job in my industry, and then maybe work on some other side hustles moving forward. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm kind of just really, um, really focused right now on school, just trying to get done and build my career first, establish that career first, a stable source of income. Then I can slowly start to venture into into, um, building multiple streams, whether it's... um, start another business or um, looking about look, uh, trying different things just seeing what really sticks um, well life is a journey you got to enjoy you got to live it and be positive be optimistic and try stuff life is too short so why not right um, well anyways if you found this video inf- informational or um, I guess benef- if this brought benefit to you, please like, share, subscribe. Like I said, I want to really hear your thoughts. Don't be quiet. Let me hear what you're thinking. And I will definitely respond, of course. I always respond to all comments. And I really want to thank those, <laughs> like the real subscribers, because I have some people who have been, who followed me, and they always comment since I had like 100 subs. I think 200 or 100 subs. And y'all are the real ones i really appreciate appreciate it um and um like i said i really want to be inspirational to somebody's life i want to bring value to somebody's life and uh if me just getting behind a camera and just um talking or you know sharing what i what i think what i'm experiencing what i'm how i view the world if that brings value to you if you can grab something and apply it to your life this channel is a success so um leave your thoughts and comments hope this video finds you well take care god bless